Well, perhaps you've seen the discussion on how frost forms or how dew forms, but let's take a look at how frost forms in some spots and not others. Let's say it's on a clear, cold winter or maybe a late fall day. So during the day, the sun's equally heating both locations, but the grassy areas may warm, warm up during the day a little less than the pavement temperature. That's because the pavement holds the warmth. It absorbs it and holds it. But meanwhile, the grass does not absorb as much of that warmth. So the dark pavement absorbs more heat. Grassy surfaces absorb less heat than the pavement. But then as the skies clear at night and that air temperature radiates away, the pavement actually maintains some of the heat. It stays warmer than the grassy surfaces. The grassy surfaces will drop down to near or below freezing. And therefore, you may see as the air continues to cool, some frost form on the grassy surfaces when the air temperature at the grass level is down below freezing. But meanwhile, the pavement temperature remains above freezing. So you're driving down the road, the road's fine, but you see frost off on either side. That's because the pavement has maintained and held the heat of the day while the grassy surfaces has radiated it all away. That's the difference in a cold winter's morning on a clear start when you've got frost on the grass and not on the roads.